Hey guys, it's Examix here, and um, I'm a dirty little Canadian who likes to play Call of Duty. And last video, I apologized for not having the intro, and I don't have it on this video either because this is an old video and it wouldn't Destroy save. Um, I didn't want to speed this up because I'll be behind in the times, and I sped it up before and I did the commentary. And it was kind of old, so I wanted to renew it. It's like the third time. The first time I'm doing a new one. Um, using the riot. Sh this is the riot shield game I was talking about. Um, it's like 11 o'clock in the morning right now, and I woke up at like 7 and go to sleep again. So, and there's nothing to do all day. I was watching Spider-Man 1, and it's pissing me off because they won't fucking play two or three. And I've seen the first one about seven times in the last fucking week. Well, I'm watching the entire thing, but it's been on. I just want to watch the other ones, and I can't. Can't seem to. Uh, they don't feel they like putting them on for some reason. I haven't seen those movies in like a year and a half or so. Probably more. I mean, definitely more than that. Um. Oh yeah, this is going to be a two-part video. Because for some reason it didn't keep the speeding up, and it's like 12 minutes long. So this this part is like 8 minutes and 32 seconds. I'm gonna put a link at the end of the video, um, like an annotation thing, to the part two. And if that doesn't work, um, just check out my channel, and uh, it should be there. Um, see, this is the part of speeding up just because it's so boring me sitting with the right shield. Uh, I was playing a game the other day where I'm trying to get this knife only gameplay, and this kid's using a riot shield, and it was pissing me off because, I mean, I don't use a riot shield, I use a C4 kind of thing, and I was going all by myself, and they were going in kind of like groups, which is usually what you want to do, but like they were sitting there with riot shields just to cover their back, and they were using scavenger and there's RPGs. I mean, I'm using scavenger RPGs, but I, th I think I only get like one kill with the RPG. That's all they were using. And it was like stupid. And it's like, our entire team was camping in the back. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it, I'm gonna start noob tubing. They're like, why are you noob tubing? I was like, kid, you're fucking using an RPG, that's it. You're not, how is, RPG I think has a bigger exploded in explosive or whatever radius or I don't know how to explain that then a noob tube I'm pretty sure and um I wasn't even I wasn't even using danger close they were using danger close so I mean I, I don't understand why you're complaining um here my C4 doesn't explode for some reason C4 is definitely better than a throwing knife throwing knife is probably more fun but just cause if you double tap X or if you're a PS3 player square or if you're a PC player shift I have no fucking idea what whatever your reload button is if you double tap that you don't have to move your riot shield to explode the C4 and I notice a lot of people that use the riot shield C4 setup and um, they'll have a C4 right in front of them and when someone walks by and they're gonna explode it I'll see them hit the like where you throw it on fucking button RB or whatever right bumper and they'll kill themselves, and it's like, I try to explain to them why people use the C4, is because you don't have to move your riot shield if you do the double tap X thing, which is why it's so much better. Here, these kids are riot shielding too, I'm not sure they picked it up, but there's two of them. This kid flashed himself about a thousand times, he pretty much fails. Um, riot shielding's pretty fun, most people just use it to like, boost, and, you know, it, most of them like, I'll make like a separate account be like only use me shield or something like that I have no idea um fanboy moment um my first scavenger danger close probably commando I don't know if it's ninja or not probably commando I don't really care if people know where I am I'm using a riot shield I don't care if they hear me with their turtle beaches when they come around the corner it's not like they're just gonna be like gonna right, run out and knife me, it's like, oh shit, that's a riot shield, what do I do? Um, eventually the whole team is gonna start rushing me because they're tired of me raping their assholes a whole bunch of times. And I knew they, they knew, I knew that they knew I was coming. So it's like, they're probably in the cockpit. Let's throw a little C4 right there and like, oh, fuck. Boom, double kill, get some dub skis. Um, I forget how the rest of this video goes, it's pretty old. Um, 
I completely forget what was happening. So I could have killed this guy. If you watch in a couple minutes, he, this, I don't get him. Someone else does. Uh, I start firing RPGs because I can hear him shooting through the little thing. And his ass actually appears through the wall. I didn't see it when I was actually watching. You'll see it right here. I just start shooting RPGs. That little blue wall. So his ass just appeared. If I would have shot that, that would have been the funniest kill game ever. But how the fuck did I die? It's like I hit you in the ass of an RPG. You weren't even fucking close to it. I thought that would have been pretty funny. Uh, someone else gets them, I think. Yeah. Um, the only reason I'm not, I don't know, I'm just kind of tired right now. So many things I want to talk about. Um, I'm probably going to do, I did that awesome sniper spots video. I'm probably going to try and do, like, awesome sniper spots, run down awesome sniper spots. For each, um, map go through, you know, that's just kind of like the intro video. I'd show that now be a good idea. I'll probably do a noob tube one. Like, I don't know. Really good noob tubing spots. Um, so I'm gonna probably start doing that. I'm only gonna do like maybe one, two of those a week, probably say. In like a three week, I'll probably do five as my. I don't know. Oh, this is funny. I was like, come on, it's okay, go, you're safe. I nudge him, he's like, okay, and he gets killed by my C4. Is a pretty dick move. Oh my god. I'm playing hardcore. I'm not sure if I mentioned this in my team killing video or not. Uh, biggest. I was actually going for a gameplay. Biggest dick move in the history of Call of Duty. This guy is sitting here in underpass. He calls in his care package. And I come around the corner. There's some red smoke sitting there, right? I sit there. He's standing there in the corner. Right before his care package drops, I shot him. And because I hadn't team killed anyone that round, it didn't give me the friendly fire would not be tolerated, and I stole his AC-130. It was, I got, I got like, 10 kills with it. And it was like, I'm gonna say, biggest dick move in the history of Call of Duty ever. I mean, I kinda made up for it with my amazingness, like, uh, this guy threw a care package in on Hardcore. And, uh... Someone spawned in it, and he's like, wow, what a spawn. I was like, yo, you can, whatever my care package is, you can have it. And it was a fucking EMP. I let him have my EMP. I'm the nicest person ever. But what do you expect? I'm Canadian, so fuck you. It's expected. I'm, I'm the greatest ever. Um, I don't know what else to talk about. Um, danger close is ridiculous. Like, if you throw your C4 right in front of your riot shield, even if you do the double tap X, if it's right in front of it, it can still sometimes kill you, just cause like, the danger close, like the explosion will go up and over your riot shield, oh and still take a lot of damage from that. I actually take a risk later, like I throw the C4 on the roof, so that's like even more, um, riskiness, I guess you would say, I have no idea. Um, how much time is um, there, I'll see, uh, this is end of part one, also part two, um, thanks for watching part one, go see part two, I'll continue the commentary then. Search and destroy.